for the first time ever, the Canberra Capitals are the national champions. The band is back together, yeah. It's, um, you know, there's been a lot of time between the, the old caps, our, our old caps and the, and the new caps. It's 15 years ago, so we're all a little bit older and hopefully a little bit wiser, but um, it's, yeah, it's exciting, I think, once we, it's an exciting group. I mean, we've got, you know, those girls won our first championship when they were 19. We're a lot older than um, we were when we were, you know, back then, but um, yeah, I, there's a lot of years, a lot of championships um, under our belts. They're now in their early 30s and have lived a lot and played a lot of basketball and um, I think are happy to be re reunited with some other great Canberra talent. So it's an exciting new time for our program. It was like going home. It, it was bizarre. I, I didn't think I'd feel that comfortable. Uh, I thought I'd have to, um, you know, instigate new friendship groups and, and you know, I didn't, wouldn't have any support. And I've got family there, friends that have been there for 10, 15 years that really not much has changed since, since I left. You know, playing with Billy again, it's like coming, coming back to being 18 years old ourselves. Like, we're rooming together here um, this weekend and it's hilarious. Like, we just feel like kids again, we're listening to 90s music <laughs> and doing all this stuff. Coming back to Canberra, she's, she's home. Like, nothing, nothing changes. We still um, joke and, and, and get up to mischief and, and um, nothing, nothing changes from there. She'll be one of my best friends to, to the day I die. We've got a very um, special relationship, friendship. Um, we've, we've stayed together at the AIS and then obviously um, played together in Canberra. And um, we sort of, you know, didn't play together for about six years there. But coming back together um, through the national squad and then, um, yeah, with Canberra again, it's awesome. She's um, just one of my closest friends and someone that I really trust and and playing with it's just fun. I mean, we really get each other, and I think that's the the fun part about it is that you know we you know there's genuine love there for each other, and it's the same with Abby as well. You know, we've got great friendships on the team, and um, it's it's really exciting. Must go up quickly. Got the job done. The two counts and a chance at a three-point play as Steph Talbot goes to work. We've got some young players, obviously with Steph Talbot. Um, she she's phenomenal, like her ability just to jump and she's strong. She's been around for three or four years and she's been at multiple national, um, junior national world championships. She's been at, um, uh, you know, part of the Opal squad, you know, part of WNBL rosters. Um, and we've just got young kids that are able to, to show that experience and, and that intelligence coupled with some, you know, some pretty, pretty amazing players. I think it's deeper than it's been in the part, over the past couple of years. Um, we've added some great people that are great athletes. Um, and obviously when you've got a fit Lauren Jackson, that adds to your roster as well. Uh, but we've got, I think we've got a nice mix of youth and experience. We're certainly a veteran team, but we've got some great young athletes that are going to develop into wonderful WNBL players and, and future Opals. Um, it's, but every other team in the league's got a great roster, so it's, um, which is exciting. I think it's great for the league and it's certainly good for us to have a team with great depth, great size, great athleticism. Get the block outs done, get on the oak glass and don't throw the ball away. Let's go! Coming back in this season, I, you know, there's enthusiasm, there's, there's passion, there's, she's back to um, some of the stuff that I remember, which is exploring and being creative and, and trying to find ways to, to win. Not the same ways, but different ways. Um, you know, she's, you know, she's obviously got a, an older group this, this year, so she listens to them. It's, it's very much a, a partnership as opposed to back in the day where we were, we were babies and we needed to be coached and taught and, and basically put in line quite a bit. But it's different to that now, and I think we're, we're all grown-ups, and I think it's, it's going to be a, a, a good, interesting... I guess it's one of those things where we've just got to put everything into play, hope for the stars align and um, stay injury-free. And... You never know what we could achieve this year. I mean, I feel like the sky's the limit with our group. It's just a matter of making sure that we stay fresh and, and healthy. We've got work ethic, we've got smarts, we've got youth and veteran. Um, we've got a fresh new, new place at the University of Canberra. So I think our, our program's in a space where it's about to blossom again. Mm -hmm.